Efforts across the country are trying to wind down on gun control. On Monday, a repeal of Colorado's ban on high-capacity gun magazines was denied. As a law-abiding citizen who's never had any criminal record at all, I'm not allowed to purchase the larger metal or plastic box. I'm only allowed to purchase the smaller metal or plastic box. Some have reasons close to heart to agree with the ban, like Tom Sullivan, whose son was killed inside the Aurora movie theater shooting. One second he was watching a movie, the next second he was dead. And, and I'm here so that that doesn't happen to any other Colorado father. In Boston, residents are split with the announcement of a gun buyback program. I think it's a great idea if it can work effectively. The city was considering a gun buyback for some weeks after nine homicides occurred in January. A lot of people are scared and if, if they don't have to give names and stuff like that and they can turn it in, get money, get the guns off the street, I'm all for it. And however, I think that what people would need to call into question is would the people who are selling their guns be the ones who would be using them to harm others in the first place. Mayor Walsh's gun buyback program would be the first since 2006 in the city of Boston. The administration is working on details and timing. Reporting at the Brighton-Austin Police Precinct for BUTV News, I'm Melissa Don.